Geronimo! Boom! Splat! Ow, oh, that hurt. <laughs> I guess that one wasn't as well thought out. I kind of... Oh, man, that was a bad transition. Um, <laughs> it wasn't my fault. That's just, it's just how it teleported. But anyways, guys, welcome back to the Farside server. And this is just a quick little how-to. Uh, if any of you guys follow the Farsiders... You notice that every time any single one of them comes into this shop, they say, Hey, Cluster, you're out of stock. Cluster, you're out of stock. Cluster, you're too expensive. Cluster, Cluster, Cluster. Okay, maybe I was a little too expensive, but I was trying to, I was trying to abuse the economy while I could when the server first started and I had found some saddles and all this stuff. But now it's kind of a little bit more common item. Especially with the villager trading now. Especially name tags with the villager trading. Um, to where I kind of balance, it takes 20 emeralds to get a um, name tag, but you can also find them, and I think a lot of people have found them. Um, so, you know, blah, 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 blah. So, I, I think, I okay, first off, I'm going to show you guys how to operate this thing. So, just because, there's supposed to be item frames on here. This whole sign right here says, if you don't get an item, take the item in the item frame. If no item is in the item frame, then we're out of stock. So, the whole item frame glitch has been... Every time we update a new snapshot, the whole item frame glitch keeps making the item frames disappear and the items go away. So, as of right now, if you don't get an item, just message me. But, this is how it works. So, I changed it from diamonds to iron. And these are cheap prices, guys. Come and get your items while they last. <laughs> so, iron horse armor, right? We have iron horse armor in these chests, we have saddles in these chests, and we have name tags going over here. Now, this is an automated system. So if you look in these chests, there's nothing in them. So you don't say, hey, you're out of stock. No, I'm not. I have stuff in there. So if we watch, four iron ingots, one, two, three, four, you put, it says here, your purchase is going to be in this left one, your payment goes in the right one. So payment in here. Boom. Oh, an iron horse armor. Now look at the great thing about this. There's, oh. I have it set up for two. That's why. I have it set up for two iron ingots down there. It's supposed to be four iron ingots. Um, and look at, great thing over here. Watch, same thing. Four iron ingots, one, two, three, four. Look at this. Horse saddle. Look at that. See, I need to go down and fix that one because that one's two. That one I had is two diamonds, so now I need to change it to four ingots. But you know, I know the great thing about it, guys. Watch this. The great thing about it is if you want two, look at this. You can just put eight in. Put eight in. Look at this. Two are going to come up for you. One and two. Look at that. Two items. You don't even have to. Oh, that. Okay, it's broken. I need to, I need to go fix that. So. But that's, oh, I need to go down and put them back. So that's how it works, guys. You come in here, and you put in, in the purchase one, you put in what you want, so the, our, the payment one, you put in what you want, so there's five iron ingots payment, and a name tag will come up. La-di-da-di-da, -da, look at that. So, that's how it works. If you don't get an item, you know, hopefully this item flame, item frame glitch will come about, and we'll be able to put items back on here. So that these signs are actually correct. But that's how you operate it. So, it's an automated system. So put your items in and then bring them out. And I'll have this fixed before anyone gets in here. So, come and purchase your stuff at Cluster's Horse Shop.